<sighs> Good morning everyone, happy Monday today. <laughs> happy Monday, today is Monday. That's what I was just about to say. Happy week day. <laughs> Good morning everyone, today is Monday. I hope you're all well. I woke up like an hour ago. Me and Freya and hers last night did like a little outdoor cinema thing. Basically the other day, I got a parcel from ASOS and it was like an outfit and like a little picnic cheese board fondue type sort of thing and we never ended up having a picnic because it was literally storming the day that it arrived there was a thunderstorm so we ended up last night just having a little outdoor cinema type vibe i'll insert some of the footage that i got in a second so you can see all that it was really really cute look at all this it's a big hamper of shit for a picnic so on today's menu we have camembert goat cheese and how long is this going to Sourdough baguettes, we have corn cornichos, corn chili, pickled chilies. Are you actually okay? What does that say? Cornichons, I think it is. Cornichons? Cornichons, yeah, cornichons. Pickled is chilies, it. chutney, oil, and balsamic. Bye. Picnic. <laughs> Kids, here what we have so far. We've taken the sofas outside and we've put some pillars down, and now we're going to set the projector up. Super excited for this. I just wanted to start this vlog by saying thank you to ASOS and the pop-up place. It was really, really sweet. And we had the best time, me and Freya laid out. I just watched the sky and the stars. Until like half past three in the morning. And then we came in and I literally just crashed straight out. I fell straight asleep and I've slept the entire night through. And I woke up this morning and it's Monday. So hi everyone, happy Monday. I, this week's quite a busy week. Actually, it is Fry's birthday on Wednesday and we've got some little plans. I start each vlog by saying I need to tidy my room, but for real, I'm looking around my room right now and because we had all the blankets and stuff outside yesterday, I literally just walked in, dumped it all on my floor. So next to me is a heemed, a heemed, a pile of shit basically that needs to be put away. So I want to do that. Look at this mess. This is literally all just one big ginormous mess. I need to make my bed and like get my shit sorted. So that's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. And that's what I'm. Oh, I just fell over. That's what I'm gonna do. Right, so it's a little bit later since I've actually filmed anything. As you can see, I am now even more undressed than I started this vlog. Brilliant. I said in the last clip that I was going to get dressed and ready. I basically woke up and made myself some food. Oh my god, in the last clip actually, you will have seen that the Iceland order did in fact come. I packaged all that away and made myself some breakfast. And I've just been sat out on the garden, ate my breakfast. Me and Fred just walked around to the little corner shop to get some ice lollies. So I just literally sat and had an ice lolly. But a parcel just arrived. I got some new shoes. Um, so now I'm going to take some pics in the new shoes. It's really annoying. I wanted my jumper. Basically, I want to do a video where I tie dye a bunch of stuff and I ordered this tie dye kit which arrived the other day I ordered this and I've also ordered like a plain white jumper and stuff to tie dye but none of the actual like clothes that I want to tie dye have actually arrived I ordered them on Amazon and they haven't arrived yet so I wanted to film that at some point today but I don't think it's gonna happen so instead I'm gonna try and get some Instagram pics these are the shoes that I just got how freaking cool are these so I follow a girl on Instagram called black dope you probably follow her if you're into fashion and she always wears these shoes so I thought I would um pick them up myself they're really really cool but they took me forever to find because I didn't realize, oops, didn't realize that they were such um, high demand shoes. They were quite expensive as well. So we'll just, just leave that one there. Um, and we're just gonna pick some outfits out and take some photos. I also just realized as I sat down to put these on that I did show in the vlog, literally the last vlog, that I ordered these shoes as well. And um, I basically ordered the black and white ones such a long time ago, like probably over a month ago. But they were coming from America, so they took forever to come and then they got held at customs for literally the longest time and I didn't realize they'd been held at customs. Sorry, I'm just putting my shoe on while I'm telling you this. But the email went to my junk mail, so I never actually like were notified, well I was, but I didn't see it, that the shoes had been held at customs so it like was literally in customs for like a week without me noticing and then they had to like get released and I had to pay the little customs fee and all stuff like that so I ordered them like a month ago and because they took so long to come I ordered these in the meantime so it does like I've bought an obsessive amount of shoes and I do have a ridiculous amount of shoes but also I've sold a bunch of my stuff on Depop that were my plan I feel like my styles changed quite a lot over the past couple months so I've sort of just gone through my wardrobe and been like you know what this is not really my sort of vibe anymore and got rid of a bunch of stuff that I don't really wear to buy 
buy new stuff, which may seem dumb to some people. This is the outfit. Well, this is the bottom half of the outfit. Just some flared trousers with these little shoes. Is. And then I'm going to put a t-shirt on. I want to take photos in this Tyler the Creator top because the guy that did the tops I mentioned in the last vlog, the Cold Prince guy, he wants me to like be the face of this launch as in like he wants me to be the photo that he posts, that he posts to be like, hi guys, Tyler the Creator top. So I'm going to take some photos for that so I can send him some. Also, I want some pics for my Instagram. <laughs> Good morning everyone, welcome back to the vlog. Oh god, I just nearly dropped my speaker. I am, um, I haven't filmed in a couple of days. Basically it has been Friday's birthday and we decided to have a no phone, no social media couple of days. So we basically just put our phones away, put our social media away and just celebrated Friday's birthday for two days and just chilled and had fun and it was really, really nice. We decorated all the living room. I didn't actually take any photos and now it's all back to normal. But we basically has got a PlayStation, so we set up the PlayStation and stuff. We just watched a bunch of films, played a PlayStation, all just sat, I say all of us, me, Haz and Freya, just sat around the thing, around the TV, played some games and stuff. Here we have Freya's balloons. We had more balloons, but they've all been popped because it was just really annoying. Anyway, it's now Friday, I believe. Freya's birthday was Wednesday. Yeah, it's now Friday. And I am just about to make myself some dinner. I've got a busy day today. I need to film, do a bunch of Instagram-y stuff. I'm basically, I'll show you what I got in a second, but I am doing a brand, piece of brand work with a company called New In. I'll talk more about what it is in a second, but it's really 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 exciting because I've been working on something with them literally since last year like I think November time last year I had my first meeting October November time something like that I had a meeting uh, in London and discussed like stuff to do with it and in fact it's will have been way before that could have been September time anyway it's been a long ass time in the making and it hasn't been released so the stuff that I've been working on hasn't like been able to be spoke about or haven't been able to show you guys or continue much with it just because of like corona and stuff however I'm working with the brand in a different way and I've got to do like a little haul of all the stuff but I'll sort you through that in a second I'm gonna make myself some breakfast I don't know what I want I kind of want an omelette like a ham and cheese omelette so I think that's what I'm gonna do I think I'm gonna make myself a lovely little omelette and then get on with my day I've got a the haul for Instagram and take some pics and all that fun stuff so I thought I'd just take you along on my day the um omelette has been eaten my hair looks so dead whenever I wash it like I swear it's not this dead but why does it look like this um it's probably because I don't have any conditioner so <laughs> Me. I'm now gonna sit and get ready because I need to film this whole video and then I need to take some photos And right now my face is not looking the greatest. I've got quite a few It's not showing up in camera at all, but my chin area and like my neck it's not really looking the greatest right now. It's very red. I've got a lot of redness. It's not really like spots. It's just like red blemishes all over my face. I think it's because I've been out in the sun a lot and I've been sweating and then I've been showering and I've also been shaving a lot more. So I feel like I'm being just fucking around with my chin area a lot more than usual. Sorry, that's always good. Anyway, I'm literally just gonna put some brow gel in my eyebrows and put a bit of stuff in my hair. I always get asked what I put in my hair and it's this. Well, right now it's this anyway. I literally change it. There we are. This is what I use. I got sent a massive, massive thing from um, Swatchkoff of just a bunch of like hair products. And every time I use one of them, I just get the next one out. So right now I'm using this and it's kind of fun, kind of fresh. Guys, the first day of Hello. Um, so guess what? I've done it again. I've been sat in my room all day long filming and editing. And now it is... 9.55. My brand deal. Oh, yeah. Sorry, shut your fucking mouth. That wasn't a, that was like a genuine question. I just wanted to know. Oh my god, I forgot to even show you all the stuff in the little haul thing. I said I was going to show you it and then I just never did because I finished filming the video and then I edited that and then I sent it over and then took the Instagram photos for it and then I've just been editing another video since then and now I'm all done and ready to sit and watch a movie. I'll show you the stuff in a second. This is one of the hoodies from the collection and I really, really like it, not going to lie. My camera's just never focusing these days. Good morning everyone, I am a fat whore and I never ended the vlog or even finished filming the last clip of the vlog. I know I look gross, <laughs> I literally have just woken up. Grabbed my camera and I'm like, wow, um, yesterday was really great. I said I was gonna vlog, started vlogging and then just sat and did work all day. And that's just like my life at this point. However, I do wanna show you the clothes that I did actually get from New In. I, I'm doing a whole thing on my Instagram which is like paid content, this is not part of it. So I'm doing like a, 
I had brand deal on my story, but I did want this stuff anyway, and I did ask Marcus if I could have this stuff, which is why the conversation got brought up of me actually being paid to do it. I would have done this anyway, would have bought all the clothes, so I'm just kind of gassed, not gonna lie. However, I am gonna show you what I got. I need to get out of bed, I need to get some breakfast, and I need to get my day started. I've literally just been laid in bed for like an hour looking at places to live, because we've got to move out soon, and I don't know what I want to do. We all planned, like it was literally not set in stone, but like in my head it was set in stone, that we were all gonna move out of London and we were gonna move to Manchester and I'm putting it out there for the first time I've ever said it and it could still happen I'm not like against it but then I also did sit and think like I would really love to stay in London and the reason that I didn't want to stay in London initially is because rent is just ridiculously priced and now that I don't have my student loan I've got to pay for my own rent out of my own money and I've saved like rent money and stuff and I've been careful with my money and all that and I budgeted but I just wanted a nice apartment because I wanted to move in on my own and I wanted to move out and just have my own apartment in the same apartment block as has in Friday of course but I wanted to have a little bit of time to just Space. And a price of a one bed in London is just dumb and if you can obviously get it for a reasonable price However, it's not gonna be nice and it's not gonna be what I want and I saw some amazing incredible apartments in Manchester Which were in my price range and then if you compare that price range to London the like what you can get is just so fucking dumb But then I realized that if I went further out of London, then I could potentially get somewhere that's like just as nice for like slightly more but like still in the price range. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm gonna show you what I got. I need to put on some clothes. I need to get a bit dressed. I'm just picking my nose. Love that for me. I still don't know what the hell's happening with that. I still haven't really decided what I want to do. I guess I don't have to decide just yet. So, we aren't going. <sighs> it's just stressing me out like I'm constantly thinking about it because I don't know what the hell I'm doing and I know for a fact we've got to be out of here by a certain day and it's fastly approaching. It's like three months away but it's still approaching. I just feel Easy. That's the only thing in my life right now that I feel uneasy about. So I just want to get it thought out and get knowing what I'm doing. Anyway, I'm gonna make myself some breakfast and I'll show you what I actually got from New End because I keep saying it and I keep not showing you. So I'm gonna show you and you're gonna love it. Okay? Just ignore the clutter in the background of my room. It's just a mess. So obviously this jumper did mention that. I also got this jumper in this like off-white kind of colour. Like it's like a creamy sort of it's not pure white, but it's also not like off-white. It looks quite white in camera. It's like the perfect colour. It's literally just the exact same hood hair, but in a different colour. I'm just gonna fold this up so I don't hate myself afterwards. And then I got these white shorts. These are really, really cool actually. I really like them. They've got like a contrast stitch in the back. If you see my Instagram stories, or you'll see these on my Instagram stories, then I do apologise for I'm showing you the same stuff twice, but I do understand that my Instagram's only 24 hours. And you guys probably want to see this. So yeah, just some fun little white shorts. And then then I got a black t-shirt which is literally just a plain black oversized boxy fit t-shirt which is really really nice. The material of this is so like cozy. I do normally prefer heavier heavier things but that's like a really lightweight fun little moment. These are my jeans and t-shirt that I did wear the other day that I've just sat on there. Mm, my bad. These jeans, oh my god I'm obsessed with these jeans so I have wanted some jeans that fit like this for the longest time and I couldn't find any and I may have um, potentially been working on something that is a pair of jeans that is not this color that fit similar to this but anyway i got these in black just some black like carpenter jeans with a little thing on the side super fun super fresh i really like these i'm gonna wear these a lot can't wear them right now because they're super thick and um it is boiling hot so i'm in shorts i also got the oversized t-shirt in a blue color and then I picked up this lovely little knit. This is really, really nice, actually. This is one of my favorite things that I got, and I really didn't think it would be. I sort of just picked this out on a whim, and then when I tried it on with, like, the black jeans and stuff, I really love how it turned out. But this is just a little knit moment. I say little. It's really, really oversized, so that's really fun, and it's really heavy as well. Love a little chunky knit moment. And then last but not least, I picked up these toweled tracksuit bottoms, as you can see. Just some, like, towel material tracksuit bottoms, and it's got a little cuff at the bottom. I really, really like these. I don't normally go for cuffed bottoms. Like the bottom of the leg on my tracksuit bottoms and stuff is not normally cuffed. It's not my preference. I do prefer when it's just like flowy. However, I do like these. I just need to figure out how to style a shoe with them. I feel like they go with like my Dior shoes, but I don't really know how to style them with anything else. So I'm gonna have to work on that. Can't really wear them right now because it's like 28 degrees in London. So it would be stupid to wear thick ass tracksuit bottoms like that when it is literally boiling hot outside. As I'm saying that I'm in a hoodie, I do understand that, but I want to 
that's where they started to film in. So that's the situation. I do hope you did enjoy this vlog. Like I said, I do apologize that it's been really bad and really all over the place. And it's not really been a vlog. It's more just been me saying, hi everyone, I forgot to film. Here's what I'm doing right now. Here's me cooking. That's literally all this vlog's been. I do apologize. My life's just really repetitive and boring right now. That like obviously with lockdown and stuff, can't really do anything. So I'm just waiting on Bozza J to actually let us know when we can leave the house and start doing fun things. Still can't really do anything. I think shops and stuff are going to open soon as well. So maybe it'll resume as like semi-normal life sometime soon. But I do apologize that the vlog has been a little bit boring, a little bit repetitive. I do want to vlog because I absolutely love this channel. And I think, I know I said in this vlog that I am struggling to find somewhere to live. I think we may have found somewhere. And I say we because there's a couple of us that are planning on maybe moving in together. Or maybe not moving in together but moving into the same apartment block as each of our intentionally potentially neighbors and maybe I have a new flatmate who knows anyway I'm gonna leave the vlog here I do hope you enjoyed regardless I will um, pick up my camera if you want me to continue doing these vlogs even though it is a little bit boring and it's just me in the house please just let me know because I do enjoy filming them um but yeah that is the situation I hope you enjoyed I love you a lot and I'll see you very very soon bye also if you're new to my vlog channel please do not have this expectation of the vlog normally they better if you want to go watch my LA vlogs and stuff I'll leave the link to those below I have been watching those non-stop lately like my LA vlogs the Paris vlogs all that and stuff um this is not this is not what you normally get this is just like a little makeshift thing for whilst we're stuck in the house anyway i love you a lot and i'll chat to you soon bye